the NF Extra this week, uh, there was a 5-3 win for Clayton's team. 5-3 win for Clayton's team. Uh, quite a competitive game, to the, a crucial moment in the game, crucial decision in the game. Uh, Clayton, what do you make of the uh, corner that was incorrectly given? Well, I have to be honest, I didn't quite see the incident myself. But going back to our 6-3 victory, um, you know, a lot of lads put a good shift in tonight. We had a few lads coming back from injury, particularly Danny, who'd been off for a couple of weeks with a cruise ship. He's come back, he's banged three goals, and I'm very, very proud of the lads and a good performance all round tonight. I should be looking here, shouldn't I? You say Danny's been on a cruise ship? All oh, right, very good. Uh, there's Clates taking the Ars and Wenger approach. Um, there was one particular corner, and I think we psychologically, on the losing team, we psychologically lost it. Uh, Griff, what did you make of the result? I think it was very disappointing, and a lot of it hinged around that uh, very dodgy corner decision. Um, very difficult to, to, to get your minds back on the game when when a, a team is happy to give you a corner until you score from it. Um, I'm not sure where that sits in the rules of football. Um, but OK, it was good. We, we, the team did very well. Um, but we will pick ourselves up, dust ourselves down, uh, count our toes from the stamped feet that we've had this week and, uh, and see how we do next week. Uh, just for the record, after the game, it was clarified by <coughs> honest Stan, Stan Aldo, that it was actually a corner and we therefore led 3-2 and in all the furore, they went and scored. Who's interviewing you? you? You're meant to be interviewing no, everyone else. Pass. I'm just reporting the facts. Um, so uh, that's all from me and uh, we look forward Can to I next week. Can I say week. something else before you go? <laughs> Over to Paul Clayton. With regards to the stamping incident that Chris is alluding to there, I mean, I didn't see it myself, I was too far away from the incident. <laughs> but I did believe it just went down like a sack of bricks and it, it was a bit of a, a dive. Uh, and that's from uh, uh, Clay TV, now sponsored by Tuba Grip, just, just for clarification. Uh, Griff, what did you make of the stamping effect? Uh, I wasn't actually referring to Clay because I didn't notice that he'd stamped on my foot actually. I was actually talking about James, but um, it, that's what happens. It, it's, it's easy to get confused when um, most of your team is stamping on most of the opposition throughout the whole game. It's just one of those things you have to put up with. I can understand why Clay, he's a young lad. <coughs> Um, he's going to get confused. It's difficult for him <coughs> to try and concentrate on walking, passing, and talking at the same time. It's got to be difficult. These lads. That's all from me. Thanks to Captain Griff. Thanks to Hale Murray Clayton. Cheers. Uh, see you next week at TNF Extra.